Back under center for the first time in four weeks, Fields fueled the Bears' offense by totaling 273 yards between the pass and run games, the third-year pro completed 16 of his 23 pass attempts for 169 yards and a touchdown. Fields finished with a 105-point to rating, his third-best mark this season. Fields took control of one of the league's top rushing attacks by carrying the ball 18 times for 100 for yards. Fields surpassed 100 yards on the ground for the first time this season, but it marked the fifth time in his career he cracked the 100-yard mark, his 18 carries tied a career high, which he set against the Falcons nearly a year ago on November 20, 2022. With three interceptions by the defense and a fumble recovery on special teams, the Bears recorded a season high in takeaways. Sunday marks just the third time in Lions quarterback Jared Goff's eight-year career that he threw three or more picks, with the last time being Sept. 29. 2019. On Detroit's first two possessions, rookie cornerback Tariq Stevenson grabbed his first career interception, then linebacker TJ. Edwards recorded his third career in and first with the Bears. In the third quarter, Stevenson forced a fumble on a Lions kickoff return, and linebacker Demarquis Gates recovered it, which led to a Bears touchdown. Linebacker Tremaine Edmonds ended Detroit's ensuing drive with another interception, his second of the season, which came off a tipped ball by defensive tackle Jervin Dexter C. Oster. While the Bears carried a two-possession lead into the final for 15 of the game, the Lions came alive to score back-to-back -to -back touchdowns and regain the lead, a safety on the Bears' final drive sealed the comeback. The Bears' star receiver hit a new milestone against the Lions, surpassing 6,000 career receiving yards and reaching 800 this season. Moore is the first player drafted in 2018 or later to reach the 6,000-yard mark. Moore caught seven of his nine targets for 96 yards, including a 39-yard touchdown pass from Fields in the third quarter. Moore now sits at 6,090 career receiving yards. For the first time since week three against the Chiefs, the Bears' defense allowed over 100 rushing yards. In the last seven games, Bears' opponents have averaged just 56 point for yards on the ground. Lions running back David Montgomery led the attack, recording 76 yards on 12 carries and a touchdown. Jamir Gibbs added 36 yards on 8 carries and a score. For the majority of the game, the Bears' offense was in control, orchestrating four drives that had at least 10 plays. The Bears' dominated time of possession the offense was on the field for 40-24. to 24.